My name is Coach Ayeri Sylvester. I'm from Edo State. I'm 24 years of age. I'm the head coach of Flabogaveg FA and also the head coach of Raneri Football Club and also the head coach of Raneri Ladies Football Club, all based in Lagos. I love football so much. Like, I love football so much. It has always been my dream to be a professional, professional footballer. I'm very good. I'm not bragging about that. I'm very, very good. I've won a lot of personal awards, captain. Anything I play, I've, I've always been the captain. And also, most times, I'm, I'm always the best player in that team. So that part I was good in. It. So that actually make my dad to always believe anything that I have to do with football. But they gave me a condition that before they will give me full support, I need to secure my future because they make me to understand that this is Nigeria. In as much you want to follow your passion, you must safeguard your future first, which is you must go to school. So I did my part of going to school. Then during the end of my youth service, that was 2015. So I met my dad, told him I want to switch to coaching. Uh, why? I feel more, more passionate in that line. I feel I'm, I'm alive in that line. I feel more useful. In that line, so I was able to convince him not to talk. I will, I will, I, he now promised me 50k that I should go and look for the red by myself. That maybe let me in born. I don't come kill him before he time. Stuff like that. So I said, Ah, thank you, thank you, 50k. So I was, I was able to pay half at first, that was, which was 130. So I started. I wasn't going to a class because I needed a certificate. I was going to a type of annoyance. I want to learn everything that is learnable in NIS. That's why when anytime people attack NIS, I got very annoying because I went there with so much passion. So my first result I got was 4.84. Like straight A's, all the courses, I said B. And like, who is that guy? That was not even my target. My target was to learn. I just want to be good. I wanted to be the best. That was just what started. Just have to be the best. So anytime I was doing coaching practice and I play, why are you in NIS? That I should go, or that it's not time for me to come here. I said, Don't worry, I know what. And then they thought I was confused. Because they say, you are, you are this good, why coaching now? I said, Well, this is the path I've chosen. I want to start early. I want to be the youngest coach. I want, ah, that guy is the youngest coach in Nigeria. That guy is the youngest coach in the league. That guy is the young. I like that word, the youngest. Not just the youngest, the youngest professional coach with this qualification. This, this. That was, that, that's the energy now. I don't want to be using part, that is the energy. So I finished my NIS. During my NIS course, I got this first job, Ranieri FC. I was doing it for free. Yeah, don't worry, I'll be coming. I just want to start experimenting my tactics. I want to create my own philosophy. That was just the push. So I started with Ranieri, with Social Liga, they play Social Liga. So we finished third. Then yeah, Flabogaveg, train, train, train. Then I went back to Cardinal during, so I got a job in, Cardinal, in between Echo Zero. I played for a captain Echo Zero then, so I, I put to coach. We played total, of, total, matches of, total number of 25 games. I didn't lose anyone in Cardinal. So I told myself, okay, because I, I assess myself a lot. People say I brag, they say I sit up. In Nigeria, nobody, we don't know how to press people, we don't know how to support. So I've chosen to be my audience. I've chosen to be my greatest supporter. So each time I assess myself, like if you can coach in Kaduna unbeaten, then it's time for you to leave Kaduna and go to Lagos. There's no audience in Kaduna, and that's why I choose. So when I made that decision to just come to Lagos, I knew it was going to be difficult. You can leave my apartment, my comfort. I, no, I said, no, it's going to be, it's, it, just, it just have to be Lagos because the media is there, the love, the supporter is there, the business part of sports is there because I don't just want to be a poor coach. I want to be a very rich coach. If for me to leave football at this stage, it's because the coach I've chosen, I must find a way to make it work. So the whole idea of being professional, going for the best qualification, all of them, I want to have it. Because that's the only thing that gives me joy. So I say that is my safe zone. During my coaching course, my first year, second semester, there's a player I coach in Kaduna. 
So he moved down to Lagos. So he called me that he would want me to come and handle a particular thing. At first, I was, how do I combine coaching and the academics? So he persisted that, please, I should just pick this job, that the boss is busy jamming. I said, okay, well, I'll come and see the boss first. So when I went there, I kind of emotionally connect to the thing. So that's how I pick up the thing. So I started working from there. I told my boss, if we want this team to grow, we need to play any tournament in Lagos, be it FA, any competition. That's the only way we can, if we are good in this job, if the boss, because it's a traveling team. So that's, that's the only way to assess this player if we are good and everything. So to date, we've not lost any game at home. We've remained on beating at home. So, but then I noticed anytime you want to play the big teams in Lagos, they don't want to play you. Probably maybe they don't know the name. So I noticed that the big team want to play the big teams. The black or boss to boss want to play Dominos Sport. Boss to boss want to play 36 Lion. We just, have to, we just have to find a way to play these guys. That's the only way we can prove our world. Because I said, for you to be the best, you need to be the best. And I know what my players can do. I know what they've done. But you can't actually brag about it because those other teams have not seen you. You've not played them. So when I had about three league, and I fought, the previous season, I used to go and watch. So I love the package. I love the competition. I said, this is where I need to prove myself. This is where I need to be. So I was able to convince my boss. So we paid. So now we're in three real league. Now what the other teams don't know is I know them. They don't know me. I know most of their philosophy. I know most of their tactics. I've seen their player mentality. But they've not seen my own player mentality. You understand? So it's going to be like a sudden event. When who is this team? Before they will know what's happening, we're already there. You understand? So it's for me as a coach, as a young coach, three really league is something I look up to every day. Like, okay, my plan is to have the from the fashion taste, the touch like charisma, the drama, you know, the action, the tacticality behind the scene. To me, I've to myself, I'm going to create a storyline with this really league. It's going to be a big platform for me. Where as I'm, I even talk, I have a plan of getting my own personal camera. I will just focus on me because this is me using Surreal to build my own career. Same thing for the player. So it's for me, I don't know about other coaches. For Surreal it's a big package. So I've seen the end of it. I've seen what I can benefit from it. The matches. Playing boss to boss is a game I'm looking forward to because it's, it's a game that I know that I can use to prove my own tactical philosophy because I, I'm, um, my own philosophy is I call it proactive protagonist. It's a tactic I'm trying to put out there. Other things I've experienced it, but I want to use boss to boss because to me, it's, they're the best for now based on their previous sources and everything. So if we can beat them, I know I can beat them with my players are ready, that is just the height of it. That is the highlight. The other team I'm looking forward to, Domino Sport. Yeah, I want to play. I've played them before in a friendly match, but I still want to play them. So, it's really it's just what I'm. It's my next challenge. It's my next success story.